Hello folks, the old hunter here. Every now and then I get on my soapbox and preach and yell about a few things I think aren't right. But it's all just my opinion. Nobody has to agree with me, but it's how I feel. Well, I, I just done an episode a little while ago about a very dear friend of mine, Frankie Wiggins, that's touching gold over Natchez the hospital. I asked everybody to please put him on the prayer list and all. Well, Right here in my house here, we got our power the next day at one o'clock. We had six neighbors. Didn't get the power for six days. After numerous calls down to Magnolia, down in Macomb, and was told, well, we're gonna get the heavy polite, heavy populated areas first. I totally agree with that, I do. But here's what was ridiculous. There were no poles down out here. There was no line down. All it was, the breaker thrown on a transformer. It takes about 20 minutes to come out here with a hot stick and set the damn breaker. And these people don't want out power for six days. One of them's daughter is very sickly. Had to stay in that heat because they didn't have an air uh, generator near big enough to run an air conditioner. Had one just to kind of load a little fan and, and, and run a refrigerator. But hey, you think in the daytime, middle of the day, when he gets like 95 outside, it's like 110 degrees. And these older trailers, there's not much enslaved. So you look at that 110, 115 degrees inside that trailer. They suffered. And here she is, worried to death about a hug and not making it, and having to live under these conditions too. And my other neighbor, her daughter's in, in horrible shape. And the same thing with her, having to suffer like that. And there was no reason for it. None whatsoever. They could have sent somebody out here. I know they wouldn't. Everybody wasn't tied up 24 hours a day. They had somebody they could have spared for 20 or 30 minutes to come out here and set that break because that's all it was. Now, I think that's bull. And as much as we pay for electricity and all like that, I don't like that service at all. I don't like it. I don't know how the rest of you people feel. But, and I will agree, hey, yeah, you know, if we had a bunch of line down like it was going to take three or four, five, six days, I can understand not bringing a big crew out here for five or six people when you got heavier populated areas that needed the power too. But under them circumstances, they were told from day one, because electricity come out here, looked at the head, y'all break us from, that's what's wrong with your power. I can't believe they waited six days to send somebody out here and do it. And the young man that come out here and do it, he apologized to my neighbor. He said, this should have been done right off the bat. Well, I'm going to get off the soapbox now. And everybody have a great day. And don't forget, put Frank Wiggins on your prayer list. Thank you.